Um, we're now here at the at the site where the Widow Scallon's pub used to be. It's now an apartment block. Now, although this site has uh, no connection to the East Horizons, we as Irish Republicans could not walk by here without mentioning what went on here on Friday, sorry, the 21st of May, 1994. Um, the Widow Scallon's at the time is where many Republicans in Dublin held their ballot sessions, and after commemoration, we always went back to uh, the Widow Scallon's and. And that night, the UVF came to basically plant a bomb in the pub. Volunteer Martin Doc O'Dorothy, he uh, confronted him, and unfortunately he lost his life. There's no doubt that night that Martin Doherty saved about 100 people's lives. He uh, very bravely faced down, he was unarmed, and he bravely faced down two or three armed UVF men who were trying to plant the bomb. It's also worth noting, guys, that Martin Doherty gave his life for a 32 county Irish Republic, which is the exact same reason the men and women of 1916 fought and died for as well. So, there's many people here today that knew Martin Docco, that served time with him, and one of them is the proprietor of the Widow Scannons that night, so I'd ask Jimmy Dunn, who was a, a, was a friend of Docco's, who owned the Widows at the time, and also served time with him Port Leach, just to lay some flowers here on, on behalf of the IRPWA in Dublin. Thank you. So guys, we're just going to keep walking down to the next set of lights and we're going to take a right onto Mackin Street. Thank you. Thank <laughs> you. 